Hey guys, for those of you who don't know me, my name is Lindsay and I am a paranormal explorer. I have not posted any content for a very long time, so I'm really excited about this video. So about a year ago, I investigated Hotel Apache and I just returned back hoping I can communicate with some of the spirits that I encountered. So here's what I found. Oh, okay. So we got. That's the bathroom, right? Whoa. Well, it's no, either. What? REM pod went off too. The REM pod went yeah. off, so it would be that sensor by the REM pod. Oh. Okay, so we have a sensor going off right now in this room. Oh, I just got chilled. Dude. Okay, so the REM pod went off in here as well as the sensor on the table, which is right next to it. It's facing the other way. It's facing the wall. So whatever it was was right here. Hey guys, so I'm back at Hotel Apache once again. Um, this time I'm not by myself, I'm joined by some friends, so I'm going to have them introduce themselves. So, What's going on guys? My name is Justin, uh, Spurter Paranormal. I have my son Austin with me. What up guys? Austin, aka Elite, from Spurrier Paranormal. How's it going? Before we even, well before I started filming, um, we already had some stuff going on in our second room. So we have two conjoining rooms. In the other room, a motion sensor at the table we have set up started going off as well as the REM pod. So things are already starting to go off. Uh, what we wanted to do is start off with the Ouija board and see if we can stir up some activity. So I think we're going to start with that. You guys ready? Let's do it. Yeah. Let's do it. Um, is there any spirits here that I have come in contact with on previous investigations when I've been here? Can you say soldier boy? <laughs> the soldier that liked me last time I guess is not here to protect me. Even though I still got a nosebleed when he said he was going to protect me. So, can you give me a physical number of how many spirits are here with us currently? Okay. That's what a is Z. it? Z. easy. Okay. Does that translate to anything that you know of? Is there someone else that could use the board, please? That we can maybe understand a little differently? We do appreciate you speaking with us, but we would like to give other spirits the opportunity to come through. Is it a B? It's in between B and C. Can you clarify? S T S T S D A A. STD, I guess. <laughs> oh, that got some energy going. Do you see yeah. your laughter? Like all of a sudden it takes off. It's crazy how how much emotions play into this. So STB. 
Is that what you're trying to say, yes or no? I know I said it wasn't an SDA, and now it's on C, SDAC. What is that on? Stacy. That's a Y, right? I can't see. Can you clarify? Yeah, it, from from what I'm seeing, it's on the Y. Yeah, it's. Stacy. Her mom's got it going on. Right? Is that, <laughs> that's that, the song that was in my head this morning, like today, so that's crazy that that would pop up. But Stacy, can you tell us how old you are? I see what she did first. If you went S T C A C. Oh, yeah, she did go A C. Two. Can you give us the second digit of your age, if there's a second digit? I'm assuming you're not two. <coughs> Oops. 20? 20. Okay. 20 year old Stacy here on the line. Are you okay where you're at? No. Where are you currently? Okay, we have an N. Which is the starting point, assuming. NZ, so. New Zealand. It's funny you say that, but I'll have to explain that to you later. But no, I, I think when they go to the extremities like that, it usually is. I think maybe we need to ask another question. Um, yeah. Stacy, was that you that had set off the motion um, sensor in the REM pod before? Was that you? Well, we're, th we're very thankful that you did that because that's why we set them up, is for you guys to come and, and try to do that, to let us know you're here. You say no, but I say yes, so <laughs> that is what we set them up for. Do you like them? Oh, I went to, you yeah, know. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> she doesn't like him, but she set him off. Just to clarify, she's going to know. Just to clarify, yeah. Just to clarify. So, can you do that again for us? I mean, how amazing would that be if we could actually have a spirit tell us that they're going to do this, and then you go and do it? You can prove your existence to the people watching. Many people don't believe in you. Yes. Yes. So can you set something off? We have a lot of different equipment set up within these two rooms. Can you set at least like one thing off so we know that you're here? We also have these cool devices here that you can make a whole word pop up for us so we can see it. Where'd you go? I think that concert's like getting wild out there. It's like dead <laughs> Stacy went to the concert. <laughs> I wonder if um, you could use, use the pendulum and try to like directly talk to her through that instead. Yeah. Maybe that can work better. I mean, it does keep pointing at it, which is kind of weird. Like, yeah. So let's move this to goodbye and shut it out. And then, and then we'll um, come back to this, maybe come back to this. Yeah. But I want to see if maybe he can use the pendulum and ask her some like yes and no questions that could be easier yeah. for her to communicate.
Can you show me my yes? All right, thank you. Can you show me my no? All right, there we have it. All right, can you go center, please? All right. Can I get in contact with Stacy? Okay. Stacy, are you here in one of the rooms with us? Yeah, she's in one of the rooms. Are you in this room? No. Are you in the room with the rim pod and the laser grid? Are you in the other room? Yes. If that made sense that she was sounding it off in there. She could still be. Yeah, but she has really long arms if she could like touch the board with us, right? She hopped in here for a minute and then she was out. Stacy, could you could you sound off any of these devices we have set up? We have a we have the periscope plasma, we have a rim pod, we have alarm set up everywhere. Could you do that for us? A lot of people don't believe you exist. We have thousands of people watching right now who, who would like to see you. Oh my god. Good, crazy. I've been seeing a lot of dust on here, but I just saw something that looked different than all that. It was like a really bright orb that was right over there. Okay, and my camera didn't probably affect it, huh? Like no, I, I haven't moved, and I've been seeing like things that look more like dust, but I saw a really big bright. No, it's not your camera. It was something else over there by the wall. Okay, Stacy. If we stop the pendulum and give a moment of silence, could you do something to get our attention? In just a few minutes, could you do that? All right. Thank you. I'm going to stop and we'll sit in silence. That's like the hardest thing ever. <clears throat> what? Prevent? Think. It didn't sound like it said think, but it said think. Send. Send. Yeah, it said send. Send what? What would you like us to send? <laughs> Pretzel time. <laughs> God. Did you, um, did you get a tequila shot last night? <laughs> Go, go okay. Down. Tequila shot down. Okay. <laughs> Whoa, what, the, dude, dude. what was that? What was that? Oh, Whoa. What happened? Oh, shit. <laughs> sorry. Uh, I'm sorry. You're that sorry. bored? <laughs> what? You're that bored? Dude, no, sorry. I had the prank. I had the, I had the prank. He, he had to get I'm sorry. Oh my god. I slammed that shot. That's what it was. You're dumb. Uh. <laughs> no, what I was saying was, um, doing stuff that raises your like I know. Like, you know, laughter, your emotions, it could cause other things to happen. So, what do you guys think about that, though? The bang, or what, the noise? Well, because we've always been tr Whoa. Uh, <gasps> Oh! What the? Oh my god! The music box is going off. Dude! Yeah. Is that Stacy? If that's Stacy, can you play a note for us? Did you hear a whisper? Yes. Did you not hear yes, that? Was that, that you? I, oh no, I heard that. I heard that. That was loud. That was actually loud. Holy crap. Oh, yeah. Was like no, like no, a... that was a clear whisper. Yes, That's on someone's so camera clear. for sure. Oh, dude. Yeah. What the fuck? You didn't hear that? I went like this. No, no, no. It was in my hand. No, it was like no, a word. It was, it was, it was like a clear it was like a clear word. It was in my ear. Was it in your ear? I feel like it was behind, like almost like I behind me. Thing. No, it was like a word. Like I no, heard, yeah. like I don't know what it said, but there was it was. A word for sure. Yeah, no, that was actually loud. Now that we're all in here, it's actually. Came it from... almost felt like it came from like, but because I feel like it's behind me that it came from the bathroom, but I could be wrong. But the bathroom's closed. So. Which way were you facing with that, Mike? I was facing me. It was like right here. We were both facing that way, I guess. Whoa. Was that you that whispered? Can you whisper for us again? 
<laughs> Once for yes. Twice that was me that time. Okay, okay. okay. yeah, Once no. For you. Whoa. Stacy, was that you that whispered for us, or was that someone else? Once, yeah. once if it was you. Sorry, but I hear Bon Jovi's living on the prayer, and it's like making me really excited. Did you hear it? Like the yeah. crowd is singing. Once if it was you, Stacy. Two if it was someone else. It's like every time we turn away and don't pay attention to it's it, like it starts going out of a normal conversation. Yeah, it like doesn't want us to pay attention to it. It's almost like when we went in the other room. What? You kick something? There's just a few knocks or whatever. I don't know, yeah. unless I kicked that, but I'm, I don't think so. Stacy, do you want a pretzel? Can I ask? Got to offer. Got to make an offer. Does anybody here want a pretzel? They're flavored. I'm supposed to point that out. Yeah, he, he, he didn't tell me that they were cheddar flavored and not that makes, <laughs> it makes a big difference. Wait, what, what flavor are they? They're not, that's the original flavor, it's not like. Okay, it's cheddar. Their original flavor is cheddar. Thank you for making that noise. What? I know, what was that? Stop. No, I'm not playing. I just grabbed my water. What? What happened? There's like, like a little. Like a little, uh... I feel like ever since I've been carrying these chips around, things have been happening, I'm just saying. Like one of them involuntary noises that... No, are, no, no. Okay. I heard it. But it sounded like it was right here. Soldiers. Soldiers? No, it did not say soldier, did it? Yes. Are you kidding me? Why? Why? No, no, I've been... Oh my god, have I not been trying to communicate yeah, yeah. with the soldier? Okay, backstory. Quick backstory, the last time I was here, my psychic was um, with me and we were communicating specifically with a soldier that really liked me and he was protective of me. And the entire time we've been sitting in here while you're in the other room, I was trying to communicate with the soldier. Oh. And I'm pretty sure I even said, imagine soldier popped up on that. And soldier literally just popped up on this. That is insane. I'm so excited right now. My soldier is here. <laughs> My here. my soldier boyfriend is here. My my ghost boyfriend. Okay. Um, what was that? Was that the air turning? But the air. Oh, oh. the car, right? There's no cars that drive outside there. That's where the Fremont Strip is, like where people walk. That seriously sounded like. It sounded like the. Air. I thought the AC oh, wow. was turning on. Yeah. No. Oh, it was, I thought it was too, but it. Huh. Not pretty loud. Oh no, there's just a wall out there. There's nothing. That's not even where people walk. All that's out there is another wall. What? What the heck? That was loud as shit. Like it sounded like the AC turned on. It yeah. sounded like, yeah, like. It was like this. It either had to be that or something sliding on the uncle. Like this, like. It literally. That was me. Down. It literally sounded like. Let me see. I feel like it was like louder than that. Yeah, it was louder than that. Like, what if it was like this sound, like, like a floor sound, like something dragging, like, I don't know. I mean, I try to. In my head, it was loud to the point where I thought it was a car, but it was over here. In my head, the AC was turning on. Like that's, that's like what I thought that's too. yeah. That's the first thing I thought. Oh. But if I peeked out there, and that's just more windows. Like there's another well, wall there out there. Did you hear that? There was just a knock in here. Yeah. In the other room. Yeah. Like a pop. Okay. Like a. I'll stay in this room. Hello? Someone making noises in here? I wonder if I sit in here and try to communicate with that soldier if like anything will happen. Yeah, I think we should try different things in here. Okay, so Austin was just in this room by himself for a little bit and nothing seemed to be happening. However, before he came in the room, we had things happening. After he left the room, things started happening again. We had the music box going off. So now Lindsay's gonna hang out here for a while by herself. And then I suppose it's gonna be my turn. So how do you feel about it? You ready? Yeah, I really feel like if I try to communicate with that soldier, something might happen. Just because we were consistently talking about that soldier popped up on the obelisk. And now we're talking about the soldier and the music box is going off. So Dude. I feel like I feel like he wants to communicate with me. I don't know. Last time he kept coming up, and I'm on the same floor, I believe, as last time. So I think it's likely that 
that's who we could be communicating with. Okay. Oh, the music box just went off a little bit. Strong came up. Okay, so now that I'm in here alone, um, I want to try to communicate with the soldier that kept coming forward the last time I was here at Hotel Apache. Um, I know that my psychic friend, Sam, kept saying that you were very attached to me and felt very protective of me. And now that I'm bringing you up and meters are going off, I'm wondering, is that you that I am communicating with? Can you give me a sign? Oh, the music box is going off. Can you come through on this device for me? Bright cube. Okay. Okay, so this is bright cube and in my head, I don't know if I'm making this up, but I'm thinking like they're talking about this because it looks like a, a bright cube. Send. There. Are you gonna show yourself on the laser grid? <laughs> Yo, stop playing. What? I didn't touch you. Dude! I know you didn't touch me. What oh. the heck? Oh, it's going fast. That's freaking weird. Some of our music boxes go fast. <laughs> no, hold on, stop playing. What was that? It's like a free. It was, uh. Did you really not fall over? I was backing away because there was just this weird white energy, and then all of a sudden the music box goes off. Yeah, that was like all at once. I thought you pushed him because I wasn't looking. I was facing the camera towards you guys, but... It's a weird... I don't want to describe it. It's weird. Was that you showing yourself? And then you went near the music box? Yeah, this thing keeps going off so spor sporadically. Yep, like that. <laughs> I know. What is, is that even the song? No, I've never. That's not even the song. You got the remix? Whoa, whoa, whoa. what? What was that? that? Yes, or like a footstep or something. It keeps leading us like back and forth in between the rooms. I'll stay here. No, it's hot in here. What? I've got goosebumps. Come in here. Is it not hot or cold? I'm. It's hotter in this room. I'm freezing. Oh no, it's hot. It's hot. It, that's just you. It's on you. Whatever it is. Yeah, it's. I'm just, it's, like, it's hot. hot. Hold this. Hold this. Yeah. Look at this. If you're a male energy, can you play the music box for us right now? Are you a female energy? It's literally every time we don't pay attention to it. It blinked. It did? It so it was a female after I said it female? It blinked. It didn't make a noise. So you identify as a female. <laughs> can whatever female energy that is here, can you go in front of that music box and make it play for us? Like I said, every time we don't pay attention to it, just like, but play some music. What if we put that sensor, excuse me, that one, like, oh, that way we long? should, yeah, because it seems like that's where everything's happening. Yeah, I'm gonna move it. Oh, music box again. It's a fan favorite. It's a ghost favorite. Every time I'm here, it's a music box. Whatever's here likes it. Is that you? I haven't set the thing up all night. So. No one's moving, right? No. Well, this thing's going off at the same time and putting words in. That's going off. There's some kind of static. That, that does it, that but you weren't moving. Mean, but I wasn't moving at the time. 
Maybe let's not touch the table yeah. at all. I'll keep my camera on that to see if it goes off. Whoa, what did that say? Tesla? And it said rocket before, which is funny. Crazy. It said rocket and then Tesla. Elon Musk, are you here? <laughs> Can you tell me how many spirits are here with me? It said no. Oh, that said one. It was a female voice and it said one. Okay, I don't know. Let me shut this off for me. I don't know if there's a camera facing this way or not, but I saw like a, an entire mist go across that laser grid. I know they have several cameras set up in here, but I don't know if they have one facing that way, but I literally saw like a giant mist going across. That was really interesting. Okay, let me, let me continue here. I know a female came forward and said that there is one spirit here in the room. Can you tell me who you are? Did you used to stay at this hotel? No. Are you the person that was in the counting room? Are you the counter? Are you evil? Bands. Like a band of money? Is this related at all to the counting room on the, the floor right above us? The counting room really is literally right above us. Something was just t -t 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 like tapping like right over here. I don't know if the camera caught that or not. Hey, were you tapping on something like I asked you to? There's like literally like there's like tapping like on both walls now. Can you use this device? Are you able to? Do you know how? I will learn. Did you hear that? Yeah. What I, said? <laughs> I will learn. That's crazy. What's your name? The one who wants to learn. That was crazy clear. Yeah. Really clear. That was. What do you feel when we're in this room? Do you feel the power of us coming together, our energy? Can you speak one at a time so that I can hear better what you're trying to say? I am really feeling tired. Did you take my energy? What happened in this room? What's the history? Oh, 
What does it say? Proof? What's the history of this room right here? Who's this laying on the bed? Can I help you? Is that what that said? I What's your name? our evening with you communicating to hear your story to take your messages but we get tired and we have to go home we have a family we have friends we have like a real human life do you miss your human life I don't know what that said in the background it's not like it said don't talk I was about to ask you, what happened in this room? Did it say dick? <laughs> You're dick something. <laughs> what about it? What happened in this room? I'll do it. I'll go in here and do the solo for a minute. Okay. I swear I just heard a voice behind me. I don't know if it was like maybe from the room, but it sounded like it was out here. Just like a, I don't know, like a mumbling, like quick, unless it came from that room. Oh wait, no, that's our that's room. Our room. <laughs> wait, I'm tripping. It's our room. Okay, yeah, no, I don't know if that was them. Yeah, I mean. But I'm saying it didn't sound like it was from in a room. I just thought maybe it like. It's just like what I heard earlier. It didn't sound like it was outside. It sounded like it was just there. Like it might have been when we were in the room. It sounded like it was in the room with us. But I couldn't explain that, so I, my mind said, oh, it's like outside. I couldn't even tell it was like that. I was just like, I don't know, I don't know. Yeah. Like a mumbling really fast, like yeah. not clear. That's weird. It's like, really, look at that. This whole wall, it don't matter where you're at on this wall. It's a portal. See that awesome thing is? It's probably not healthy. Not at all. So looking back at the evidence that I did discover, I do think Hotel Apache is haunted, and I have, over the many times I've been there, collected very amazing evidence. But on top of it, I think it's really interesting how high the EMF levels are in that building. I do think that can have a great effect on some of the experiences that you have, like me getting extreme headaches. Um, last time I did get a nosebleed when I did the Ouija board. Whether that's paranormal or related to these high EMF levels, I don't really know what to say. I think it is a combination of both, but I'll let you guys decide.